Today we're talking about the 2024 Pikes Peak International Hill Climb. Stay tuned to the end, you're going to get a chance to hear all about it. Hey guys, I'm James Dean, team leader of the James E. Mountain Homes team. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Just really quick before we get into the meat of this video, I just wanted to make sure if you haven't done so already, hit that subscription button down below, hit that notification bell. That keeps you updated on all the new videos that we have coming out weekly. And uh, we've got several that come out each week um, on this channel. So please, please stay up to date with that. Also, if you've got any questions whatsoever that are real estate related or just in the community, please don't hesitate to reach out to us and give us a call. You can either call us at 719-266-2725 five you could text us to that number as well or you can email us at info at jdmret.net please whatever you got to do to get those questions to us please ask we're here to help we're here to provide value to you and in helping you make informed decisions whether you're looking to buy or sell real estate or just typical questions for the community out here we are local experts of this area and we love this area so please 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 reach out to us and we hope you guys enjoy this video okay so this year guys we had the pike speak International Hill Climb. It's going to happen on June 23rd and it's on Pikes Peak Toll Road. So that's easy. You know exactly where that is. This has been going on for over a hundred years. This race brings in racers and drivers and crews from all around the world where they get pitted in different classes or race classes and they race from bottom to top. Uh, hopefully they make it all the way up to the top. It's always dictated based on what's happening with the weather. They can't get up there to the very top if there's ice and snow. So sometimes they have to cut it a little bit short, but they always try to get up to the top. You get to go watch that as a spectator here too. It, it is a fantastic and awesome experience to be able to do. You can go do a whole day where you get in there early. You buy tickets, you can buy them right now. You buy tickets for certain parking areas, you get up there, you have the whole spiel out there. You can bring your, you can bring a tent, you can cook, you do breakfast and lunch and dinner up there and spend the entire day up there just hanging out watching this race as it goes down. One of our favorite places to be is at the starting line because at the starting line, you get all kinds of cool things. You get to see the race crews and their tents kind of getting set up and ready to go. You've got sponsors that are down there. You get to watch each driver start from the very beginning. Really, really cool to see. There's lots of cool spots. Devil's Playground is another one up in that picnic area as well. There's lots of just really cool places to check it out. Another great way to do it is to actually park down in Green Mountain Falls and hike up Garden of Eden, and you can hike up to that starting point right there. The great thing about that is, is you can make this just a couple hours thing on it where you go up there, see as much as you want to, then come back down as opposed to being stuck there the entire day if you drive up there. But there's lots of different ways you could do this. You could also, and I've been hearing rumors that we are actually going to have places in Woodland Park, and, I, and I'm not allowed to say yet, but I will say as soon as I can on there where we will actually have watch parties down there in Wilton Park where you can watch the hill climb down there in a little bit more of a comfortable setting of a restaurant or a bar. It's down there too. So that's another cool thing that's coming out as well. But if you haven't ever, if you've lived here for a long time or if you've visited here before and you've never seen this, you definitely need to get out there and watch this. This is such a cool event. It's an all day event. <laughs> Traditionally, it usually ends up raining, which is weird out there. I don't know why it does. It just some for some reason that weekend ends up being a rainy weekend. But when it's a beautiful weekend, it is amazing. And you'll see drivers break records. We've got lots of local drivers that are here as well that compete in it. Canics, the Vashultz do, but both father and son, uh, Clint and Cody get out there and race in the hill climb as well. I don't think Clint's doing it this year. I might be wrong, but I know Cody more than likely definitely doing it unless something happens. But it's just so cool to get out there and check this out and watch this as this local event that's internationally renowned around the world. They also have a fanfare day or fan fest day that you can get out that's earlier on. Uh, so basically like the whole week, they got little events where they'll, have, they'll do different things where you can go and meet different drivers in different areas and stuff too. So really, really cool to check out, but I hope you guys get a chance to see it. Guys, I really hope that 
you enjoyed that video. And once again, before you sign off, make sure you hit that subscription button, that notification down, bell down below. That will keep you updated on all the new videos that we have come out that are here to inform you and help keep you updated on what's happening here, both in the community and in real estate as well. And once again, too, if you've got any questions, please do not hesitate to give us a call, 719-266-2725. You can text us at that number as well, or you can email us at info at jdmret.net, and we will get back to you as quickly as possible to answer all of those questions. We're here to serve you, and we look forward to helping you soon.